Art is not a study of positive reality. It is the seeking for ideal truth. There is no wealth but life. Every increased possession loads us with new weariness. To see clearly is poetry, prophecy, and religion, all in one. A man wrapped up in himself makes a very small parcel. Remember that most beautiful things in the world are the most useless peacocks and lilies. For instance, the purest and most thoughtful minds are those which love color the most. An architect should live as little in cities as a painter. Send him to our hills and let him study there what nature understands by a buttress and what by a dome, in order that people may be happy in their work. These three things are needed. They must be fit for it. They must not do too much of it. And they must have a sense of success in it. Your faults will drop off like dead leaves when their time comes. Books are divisible into two classes, the books of the hour and the books of all time. Do not think of your faults, still less of others' faults. Look for what is good and strong, and try to imitate it. There was always more in the world than man could see. Walked they ever so slowly, they will see it no better. For going fast, there is never vulgarity in a whole truth, however commonplace. It may be an important or painful. It cannot be vulgar. Vulgarity is only in concealment of truth or in affectation. He who has truth at his heart need never fear the want of persuasion on his tongue. Quality is never an accident. It is always the result of intelligent effort. Every great man is always being helped by everybody, for his gift is to get good out of all things and all persons. To banish imperfection is to destroy expression, to check exertion, to paralyze vitality. The purest and most thoughtful minds are those which love color the most. When love and skill work together, expect a masterpiece. Every increased possession loads us with new weariness. Nature is painting for us, day after day, pictures of infinite beauty if only we have the eyes to see them. A book worth reading is worth owning. If a book is worth reading, it is worth buying. Dream lofty dreams, and as you dream, so shall you become. Education does not mean teaching people what they do not know. It means teaching them to behave as they do not behave. All art is but dirtying the paper delicately. The highest reward for a man's toil is not what he gets for it, but what he becomes by it.